They say the biggest test of a team is how they bounce back from a defeat in the face of adversity. Well, Liverpool have suffered that few defeats this season. It's when Liverpool played at Turf Moor that he, he looked bright. That's Amdouni. That's a really top stop from Kelleher. Amdouni's touch and shift past Van Dijk was brilliant. Well, they've been looked really threatening, Burnley, in all fairness. It's a lovely touch, isn't it? Because he's got them in the fraction of a second. Trafford doesn't get there. And Liverpool score. It's Diogo Jota again. Who else could it be right now other than Diogo Jota? Goals galore for the Portuguese international. Well, he follows the flight of the ball really well because it comes over an awful lot of players, comes over the trap of the top. Now they're at it. And they really are at it. Because this is Darwin Nunez. That's a super start by Trafford. I think it was a Nassim Young that was playing. Delivery. And a free header. Oh, it's in. It's brilliantly met by O'Shea. And Burnley have leveled things up. That is as good a header you will see. Well, as headers go, they don't come much better than this. On the set play, it's the man win that. And it's going to break towards Elliot. McAllister stays down. Liverpool are playing on. And it's in! It's in from Luis Diaz, who made it his. Well, Alexi McAllister was lying down on the edge of the penalty area. Everyone looked towards the referee, except Harvey Elliott and Luis Diaz, who went and made a goal. Then the ball eventually breaks to Harvey Elliott, and he just fired. In space for Andrew Robertson, which he's more than happy to work it in. That's a couple from him now. Nunez was offside anyway. It wouldn't have counted, but don't take anything away from Burnley's young goalkeeper. Oh, it's a sweep of move. Interesting on VAR. Now this could be interesting because Wafana's run away. It's a great stop by the goalkeeper. Otto Bear's wild. The goal wasn't exactly gaping, but it was there to hit. And Wilson Otto couldn't do so. What a stop from Callahan. Well, he's obviously learned from the best one on one. They get a little bit lucky, dude. Then he comes off his hand for Fana, but then face one on one. Kelleher's really out quickly, isn't it? A little bit. Well, that will break for Fana, and he's not taking the chance again. Well, that's two huge moments for the man who scored twice last week. The two big chances that he's not taken today, and Burnley really should be level now. Well, I think he realises that as well, does Vincent Company. Send it forward, it's Luis Diaz, Nunez wants it. Luis Diaz is going on his own, the ball a little behind Diogo Jota. Trafford saves again. Well, it just seems to be a case of like chances and opportunities at either end. The last five minutes or so, a little reverse pass to Diogo Jota. He could have slipped in Darwin Nunez. Sends it high and long towards Van Dijk. Once Close, as close can be. It's a combination of two centre backs. It's a hopeful ball, if anything, by Anna. I think you could lose him. Well, there he goes. <laughs> Unlucky, Gary. You really thought that one straight in, didn't you? Well, he didn't make it much of a dart to his right hand side, but. Second goal. McAllister waits, so too Harvey Elliott. And deflection on the shot. Darwin Nunez was uh, a whisker away from getting on the end of it. Well, the build-up play is really good from Liverpool. Like Harvey Elliott going by Robertson. It's going to come through to Diogo Jota. Heck of a strike for Fana charging down. Elliott and Nunez! That is a classy finish from Darwin Nunez to seal the deal for Liverpool today. Lovely, lovely finish. Lovely little ball by Harvey Elliott. Get a little bit lucky there with a couple of ricochets and then a floaty little ball into the box. A little bit behind the, the Uruguayan. But he can open Burnley up enough over the course of the 90 minutes. Vincent Company side gave them a real, real game. And a... Liverpool's fight on four fronts resumes in the capital. Three months to go, a cup final next weekend. But there's two massive league games before then.
Yeah, I think it's always a busy time of the season for most Premier League teams. Nice play between Diaz and Bradley. Bradley ever willing and tight, the little toe poke. Diotto with a second opportunity. Still not clear and confusion eventually. The decision goes Brentford's way for a push in there, but how lively was the young Irishman again there? Oh, well, Flickin does exceptionally well. Little give and go. An early start, but one that Liverpool should be buoyed by returning faces, but some defending to do here as Mopek tries to find. Tony took it first time. Well, again, it's similar to Conor Brandy's here, but it's not the most ferocious of shots. Just a little sight. Time for Diogo Jota. The strike is a good one. Flecken's hand is good and strong as well. Now Liverpool have a corner. Right. Second time of asking for Van Dijk, this is an interesting one. How well did Diogo Jota do here? Nunes for now is onside, Nunes all on his own! That is a confident man! Liverpool with the lead, played more games than anyone this season, his influence more obvious with everyone, and it's goals, goals, goals! His 13th of the season, and Liverpool have a priceless lead. How well did Diogo Jota do for the goal as well? Oh, Mohamed Salah, big opportunity that he took on his left foot, but it seemed to be all set on his right. And that is a big let off for Brentford. Well, that's the opportunity that one. Salah looking for McAllister. What a lovely touch from McAllister! And what a lovely goal from him as well! Just when Liverpool needed it most. And that is a priceless two-goal lead from a very classy player. Bradley with some distance here. Not that far over the top either. Good header on that from Cody Gatko. Look at the pace of Mohamed Salah, who had absolutely no right to catch it up. Collins does well, but not well enough against the returning Mo Salah. Back with his usual bang. First we've seen of him since New Year's Day. It's his 19th goal of the season, and that should wrap it up for the Reds. Well, it's the same old, same old. This ball forward, Lisa looks interested. Challenge comes in from Canate. Chance, what a great save. Not the second time from Tony, though. Felt inevitable to a sense that Tony would be involved, trying to make up for lost time after eight months out. It's another goal for him, this time against the team he supported as a kid. It's his 14th here in the last 18 games. Keller has Diaz in, he could see Gravenberg. Cody Gakpo over his shoulder, wraps it up for Liverpool. Cody Gakpo at double figures now for the season, but he's made it safe. And it's all smiles from a Liverpool perspective. Three points on the way. Well, it's a catalogue of errors, Williams, wouldn't it? What a great error as well. That is that. They've been magnificent again today in another. They are weary and they are scarred right now. But this Liverpool team is battle hardened. Jurgen Klopp has had to build them up again after a bruising day at Brentford at the weekend and send them out. It's going to go the other way. It's a lovely ball. Picks out the pass and Liverpool go again. And it's another big chance that Luis Diaz can't take. What a miss. Great ball from Elliot. Doughty, this is Woodrow, and that's Chong, that's beautifully done, and it's in by Ogbeni. Well, that's the risk that Luton have. They scored four in their last away game in the Premier League at Newcastle, and they've taken the lead at Anfield. The first shot was too hard to handle for Kelleher. And it's his Irish teammate, Chidozio Ogbeni it in. We'll try and find a way through that well-drilled defence now. Gagpo to Luis Diaz might need a bit of magic. And he snapped it early towards goal. It's comfortable for Kaminsky. Even in them situations. Well, it was lovely in its making and he just couldn't quite supply the finish. Just could not get his foot to it. Great by Endo, centre of the park, it was great. Ryan Gravenberg can't quite take it in and he strikes, he can now. For Cody Gakpo, Gravenberg does well. This is Luis Diaz. Well, it was a wobbler and a shaker. And he wanted it to dip, but it wouldn't. Everything at the moment, scoring Liverpool. Endo, 
Luis Diaz, it's a lovely take. He's set. Connor Bradley has made a magnificent. This is the, the only time he's got in in the game, Bradley. Oh, lovely ball, Bradley. Right one challenge. Looking now for support. He's found support. Luis Diaz, what a block that is by Mengi. Absolutely brilliant from the former Manchester United man. Liverpool, it's Gomez, it's Luis Diaz. They're appealing for handball. Still trying to find a way through Chong. He's lost it to Gakpo. And that's a good stop from Kaminsky. The Reds, is there a platform for Liverpool to win it? Maybe there is. Virgil van Dijk. Captain's moment. Captain's goal. Liverpool won. Luton Town won. Only one to deserve. The pressure's been immense this second half. They've not let up. They've kept going. Van Dijk gets in front of the dip. And he goes on. There's enough of a challenge. Oh, Bradley. Oh, what a save. That is from the goalkeeper via an inflection. Keeper gets defensive minded situation right now. McAllister. Oh! Here they come again, McAllister, Van Dijk, what a save again! Kaminsky with a brilliant stop with his right hand and because there's a head injury inside the penalty. A Dutch great looking on, oh here's Luis Diaz. Still Luis Diaz and that's his moment that he's waited so long for tonight. It seemed like it was never going to go in for him, but finally he makes it count. Liverpool into a clear lead in the game. Barkley's lost it. That's Endo. This is Cody Gakpo. And he just couldn't control it in the end. Gakpo could have knocked it in. And it's a lovely turn. Gakpo for four. It might be one for Elliot. That's sealed in style by Liverpool. On a night they needed a big performance. They have found one. It's Young Guns. Well, it was a night where Liverpool needed their mentality once again. And the Monsters were back at it with the most exhilarating of second half performances from Jurgen Klopp. Doesn't matter how much you've won. And he's won the World Cup. This is still very, very special. Famous Chelsea against the famous Liverpool. I say no for Gallagher. Jackson is in the middle. It's behind Jackson. It's Raheem Sterling. And it's Palmer. It's an incredible save. Brilliant save by Kevin Kelleher in the Liverpool goal. Well, he's just got a big high five from Ibrahima Konate and no. Decision is offside. Alistair. Diaz. In by Robertson. And off the post from Gakpo. McAllister. Turning to a 5 4 4 here. Luis Diaz. Harvey Elliott. Wouldn't come to Gakpo. Diaz. Bradley. Great run. Robertson's delivery. And Liverpool lead in the final. It's their captain. It's Virgil van Dijk. I tell you, there is a video assistant referee check here. 
for a possible offside. What is the decision? It's no goal. Palmer, Gustavo is in his way. and unleashing one well that would have grabbed the head of the brakes on Elanga tried to put the brakes on and he's through here with a chance to stride in and Kelleher sticks out a leg oh, what a save that is from Kelleher looking for the corner it just wouldn't settle down Diaz hovering and Clark wants it and it's there for Diaz and Murillo just threw himself in the way to rescue the situation for Nottingham Forest. It's not the greatest of contacts for Clark, but what a Here's Bradley, lining up in the middle. The touch from Dominguez just sets up the strike from Robertson. And it was all. Here he is with Van Dijk. Toffolo across. Elanga hits it! And you don't. Claimed it, gave it back, and Diaz. Simicas 
Nunez with the corner. Nunez with the touch and sells. What a set. McAllister now tries to keep the pressure on. Nunez is there! Liverpool have done it to make a telling contribution. Darwin Nunez wins it for Liverpool. Oh, it's a foul. He got very fortunate again. Sorensen turning blind. That's a penalty. Very calmly indeed. Goalkeeper set the wrong way. McAllister from the penalty spot. Meanwhile, here comes Sparta Prague. Opportunity. What a save from Kelleher. And then kept down by Gomez. Harassling denied. Nunez. Worth a try. Oh, Darwin Nunez. Piece of absolute individual brilliance. Oh, and the volley <laughs> to make it three right on the stroke of half time. Two for Nunez, three for Liverpool. Pomatovic on the chase, he got the cross in as well. That's excellent from the home team. Deflected four. And the three goal advantage is restored. Salah's waiting. Zabosta goes alone and he does make it five. All in Prague. Dominic Zabosta in. It's the fixture that defines an era in Premier League history. And in that era, you have the highest performing and the highest point totals ever seen. Today, for the final time, Jurgen Klopp. Julian Alvarez, who goes for goal and Keller has to make a good save. Manchester City pressing Liverpool inside two minutes. But, but there is a shot which is beaten away by Keller. This is Bradley. That's wonderful. Bradley across goal. And Darwin Nunez in sliding to try and turn it home as crashed into the post and they'll be hoping that that's nothing serious the Cremendo, McAllister, off goes Darwin Nunez little ball in for Lewis Diaz, Manchester City wants an offside and the flag was up very very quickly it was beautiful from Liverpool but it looked as though Darwin Nunez had just gone too soon well, De Bruyne goes near post and Manchester City have squeezed it in they've caught Liverpool on the hop there through John Stones who provides the sweetest of finishes and Manchester City have the lead well it's a really well worked corner obviously from the training to the other Bradley's chest control and pass for Elliot and a little ball summer slide well you feel on a day like this it's the sort of chance you have to take brilliant from Liverpool in the build-up a really patient build-up from Liverpool and then it's a lovely little flighty forward by Harvey Elliot to the game Lewis Diaz unlucky in the goal but he can't quite squeeze it in the post it looked for all the money in the world as though he'd done everything right there well they win it really well was totally committed and Darwin Nunez listen almost on one leg and McAllister scores wonderfully well the goalkeeper guessed right but he couldn't get there it was just too good and Alexi McAllister has brought Liverpool back into it I thought the performance in the first 45 minutes was good here's De Bruyne the thread is for Foden saved by Kelleher needed to be as well Foden couldn't where's his out ball there it is it's Luis Diaz is this his moment for Liverpool oh what a chance what a chance what a ball by Salah well his chances go they don't come much better than this one Mr. Luis Diaz McAllister and it's saved by Ortega Nunez waits in the middle here he is now and it's Ortega with a fine stop Kovacic will bring it away it's beautiful from Kwanza and lost by the goalkeeper but he manages to get in is this Manchester City's chance to win it it's Doku and it's a massive moment as the balls to City deal with it Doku well, this looks a penalty for Liverpool Doku's foot is incredibly high deemed it not sufficient and it's the final act of the game
Liverpool perhaps left a little frustrated at the end, but the final Premier League.